Okay. Now, uh, right. under uh, if if it will be possible, if uh, alternatively, if you cannot have the documents probably attached and sent back maybe by email, uh, I can as well give you. Uh, you can send to the direct fax number indicated on the forms, or I can as well give you my own direct fax number, you know, for you to send it directly to my own desk. Okay. So I might not know the proper means by which uh, you might wish to uh, send the forms back. All right. Well, um, now the um, on the uh, first page of that document, the, the two-page document that you sent me, there's a section that says references. Yes, references now means um, we need somebody that uh, should be in a position to represent uh, this account in case uh, of any unforeseen circumstances, as I stated before. Because one, uh, uh, in this case, most people call it nest of kin, but we call it references. These are the people that maybe if we call Calvin Hawkins and we are not able to get Calvin Hawkins, then we can be able to have somebody we can be able to talk to at each and every point in time. Because at times you might say, okay, I want to give Barclays Bank an instruction to transfer 500,000. And maybe when we try to get uh, Calvin Hawkins on telephone, we are not able to get you on phone to confirm you transfer. We need somebody that we can be able to talk to to ask, please, can you confirm to us if Calvin Hawkins actually authorize this transfer for so 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 and so beneficiary. This is just why we need references. Okay. And no. at times you might you might not know there are accidents, there are uh, there are traumas, there are tsunamis and there are so many things you can think of. In this case if anything happens to Calvin Hawkins, there must be somebody that should be able to represent Calvin Hawkins before the backless bank if we do not get hold of Calvin Hawkins for any reason. So that is where you get the references. You can use probably uh, your daughter, your son, your father, your mother, your uncle, your cousin, your niece, that's okay. But for the fact we can be able to get an accurate information or information on how we can get hold of this person, either by telephone or by email, I think that solves the purpose. Okay. Well, could I use my granddaughter? That's okay. That's okay. okay. But see, I don't have a granddaughter, so that... Is we need to have either his or her telephone number or his or her email address by any means which we can be able to connect to to her as okay by the bank. Okay. All right. Well, uh, that certainly makes sense then. Uh, now, I guess I can go ahead and... Uh, now, you wrote down the word bankers to the right. It's business, occupation, and bankers, so I should write down the bankers of the people I'm representing? Exactly. 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 And you don't need to give us their banking information as we stated before. If maybe the bank with uh, maybe uh, First Union Bank in the uh, United States, you can just say First Union Bank in the United States. We don't need the account details. Okay? Okay. We don't need the account number. We don't need the short code numbers and the other numbers. We don't need the ABA number. You know, All we just need is just the name of the bank. That's all. Okay. All right, well, uh, that certainly uh, cleared up the, some of the questions that I had for the Barclays Bank. I've got to tell you, I'm a little uh, leery of the having to deposit uh, 2,500 pounds into a bank account that so I don't is, even... This deposit now, uh, you are going to make it directly to the Barclays Bank account, which will have to forward to you as soon as you verify that the uh, forms you sent are okay and accurate, because uh, our accounts department has to verify the forms. After verifying the forms, if they are okay, then we'll write you back and then provide you with the banking coordinates as we do not accept any money through any fast means of transfer. You know, we don't do that here in the bank. Everything has to be bank to bank transaction. Okay. All right. Well, that certainly makes yes. sense then. Yeah. Okay. Uh, was it, uh, If you're clear, uh, okay, go ahead, sir. No, no, go ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm done. Go ahead. No, I said if you're satisfied, if you're satisfied with all this now, uh, then you can go ahead and fill the forms, and then let us have the forms, you know, uh, before uh, Monday. Okay. I don't think I should be in the office by tomorrow, but uh, that means on Monday that is when I should be able to fight up the forms again. All right. Well, I certainly will be able to uh, handle this. Um, go ahead and. Uh, I think you can expect me to have this uh, done in the next 24 hours. I'll mail this uh, Barclays Bank 
uh, form CN04382, and uh, it's the application for opening of individual corporate accounts. So, okay, no problem. And he's gone. <laughs>